Mushroom. Hey guys, welcome back to the Pokemon Soul Silver Walkthrough. In the last episode, we took on the fifth gym leader, Erica. Um, wait, was it Erica? Yeah, Erica. And in this, ep I mean, no, Gen 9. In this episode, we're going to be taking on the sixth gym leader, Sabrina. Alright, so let's go ahead and talk to Sabrina. Yes, I am right. Okay, so, um,. My microphone was gone during the pre-recording of this one. I was supposed to get the sound from my DS. Um, I didn't get the recording sound, but I still got the video. Alakazam is at level 60. It's what she's going to start off with. This is her strongest Pokemon, level 60. If you're a psychic type with the moves Gravity, Psychic, Focus Blast, and Energy Ball. I'm going to open up with a Shadow Ball here. Uh, hopefully it does about half. Yeah, it did just about half. Actually, it almost killed it, so she's probably going to heal. Yep, she healed. Great. Um, Alright, let's use another Shadow Ball. And hopefully she doesn't heal. This time we can finish it with Shadow Ball. Let's see. Ooh, Energy Ball. Yeah, Energy Ball is a Grass-type move. I was thinking of teaching Magicka Energy Ball, but um, I found out I can only get in the Battle Frontier. So I... I might do it off screen, but probably not. Alakazam goes down. Awesome. One down. Five to go. Alakazam goes down. Next up is Espeon. I consider this our strongest Pokemon because it's really, really annoying. So, 58 pure psychic type with the moves Calm Mind, Psychic, Shadow Ball, and Baton Pass. Um, let's see how much Shadow Ball does. Just about half. Um,. Yep, he's not gonna be. Able, yeah, he's not gonna be able to live a shadow ball. Um, yeah, whatever. All right, then we'll just go to sky high and use U-turn. Yeah, like I said, you can't hear the sounds from my DS because when I pre when I was pre-recording this, I forgot to put the microphone up to my DS. So, yeah, you can't hear the music or anything, so it's boring in the background. Uh, I should be able to live a psychic. Um. Now, one thing to do with uh, Espeon, use physical attacks. Because this thing is special defensive. It's great special defense-wise. Because um, it, has, it can be um, a jerk with Calm Mind. Because Calm Mind will raise up special attack and special defense. So that way it can murder you with Psychic. Next up is Gallade. Um, this is considered her strongest Pokemon. Um... Because it has the citrus berry like most of the strongest Pokemon do. Um, so yeah. So Gallade is at level 53. Psychic and fighting type with the moves Stone Edge, Psycho Cut, Night, Night Slash, and Close Combat with the citrus berry. Alright, um. Now Gallade. Um, this is a new Pokemon that came from Diamond and Pearl. Um, it's different because... It was originally, um, it's now Curlia, Curlia's other form. Um, first Ralts evolves into Curlia, then Curlia would either, would usually evolve into Gardevoir. But I think if you give it like a Dawnstone or something, then it will evolve into Gallade, so that's pretty cool. Um, you better be able to live a Stone Edge Sky High. I'm gonna be pissed. Come on, live it, live it, good. Good, okay, let's use fly and hope it uses it doesn't use stone edge again because that can still hit. Okay, good, you use psycho cut. Um hopefully fly takes it out. Um half another half. Alright, Gallade goes down. Alright, next up Sky High go to level forty nine. Next up we have Jinx. Alright, um we're gonna go to Fireball here and use Overheat. Just, just cause I feel like it. Just cause. Jinx is at level 54. Ice and Psychic type with the moves Psychic, Focus Blast, Blizzard, and Parish Song. I already went over Parish Song like two episodes ago or three episodes ago. Um, let's finish this thing with Overheat. And Jinx goes down pretty simple and I since it has forewarn I usually like to see when it says like oh forewarn alerted itself to a move the move that that it says I usually use it just to finish it um next up is mr. mime mr. mimes at level 56 pure psychic type with moves 
Reflect, Skill Swap, Thunder, and Psychic. Fail. I put Reflecty. I didn't. Uh, I messed up on my sidebar. <laughs> uh, that proves that everyone can make mistakes in walkthroughs. The easiest things people can make mistakes. Oh, Reflecty. Oh my god. Uh, it's a fail. Uh, I'm. Uh, Oh my god, I'm such a fail. Ugh. I've failed at making a sidebar. God. Oh, that's just not right. Alright, whatever. Excuse you, turn. Oh god. Uh, yeah, it has the reflecty up. So, yeah, it. Yep. You turn, couldn't finish it. Great, now it's probably gonna heal. Um, you know, let's just. Go to Red Dragon. Please. Please miss with Thunder. Oh my god, if you use Thunder, I'll be just, just be done for now. Um, let's try Waterfall. Let's try to make it... Mm, of course. Okay, first the sidebar error. Now I'm failing to beat freaking Mr. Mime. <laughs> uh, Waterfall. Okay, good. Um, now let's keep using Hyper Beam. Oh my god, okay, good. Uh... Okay, Thunder missed once. It's probably going to hit the next turn. Great. Um, Alright, let's use another Hyper Beam. Oh my god! Oh, <coughs> oh my god! What, 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 what is up with you using Thunder? And it misses. <laughs> oh my god! It missed like four times! <laughs> Finally! God, I was finally ex I was actually expecting that to hit. God, usually Thunder's like always hitting when they're battling me, but no, it missed like four times there. Wow, that's like my that's like a world record that of the most times that Thunder has missed in a in a battle against me. Um, hopefully Iron Tail can finish it off. Yep, should be able to now. All right, so Mr. Mime goes down. Five down, one to go. Last up is Wabafet. This thing. Ugh, it's just so annoying. One, it's voice. Two, it has shadow tag. And three, it's just got a lot of HP. Okay, let's start with its... Well, actually, let's start with its moveset. Wabafet's at level 53, pure psychic type with moves. Counter, Mirror, Coat, Destiny, Bond, and Encore. Okay, starting off, it has the voice. Wabafet! So, yeah, that's stupid. Um, then it has the stupid HP, where see, it let the freaking U-turn, like, that much damage. It did nothing. Oh, it's just so annoying. It has Shadow Tag, which you can't switch out unless your Pokemon dies. It's so stupid. Uh, you can't switch out, or, um, well, I think U-turn will actually work, but whatever. Let's use Thunder Wave. I, thank God it didn't. I th actually, this is like the only. I think Wobbuffet and uh, Why Not are the only two Pokemon that have the ability Shadow Tag. I have never seen another Pokemon with Shadow Tag. The only Pokemon I've ever seen with Shadow Tag is Wobbuffet. It's weird. Oh boy. Oh wait a minute. I just noticed something. It can be. It can't even do anything to me. Counter and Mirror Coat. Zeus might actually be able to take out a Wobbuffet. Wow, I just wanted Zeus to go out here to heal, but I guess you can keep going for it, Zeus. Go ahead. Go crazy. Go crazy. Go crazy on the Wobbuffet. No. Why does the Wobbuffet have lipstick? Okay, it's bad enough that a Jinx has a bra, but a Wobbuffet having lipstick, seriously. Oh, God, they're changing... What is going on with Pokemon in this world? Jeez. They're just destroying the Pokemon universe. Seriously. And they have such weird sprites now, too. God, it used to be so normal. Now Pokemon is so weird. <laughs> oh, wow. Now Iron Tail keeps missing. I bet it's going to miss new. Yep, it always misses when the Quick Claw works. When the Quick Claw gets in action, 
three times against one? Jeez. That quick claw. God, three times in this whole battle. Actually, three times against this whole Wobbuffet. It has a quick claw. The quick claw has been helping. This thing isn't even going to hit on me. Because, oh wow, it can't even hurt me. Wow. <laughs> It can't even hurt me because I'm using special attacks. The only moves that, that can hurt me are counter and mirror coat. And those only work, work if I'm using physical moves. And I'm using special moves. And Encore doesn't do anything. It just makes me use the same move over and over. Destiny Bond only works at the last turn. And Wobbuffet goes down with a critical hit. Alright, Wobbuffet is down and we just beat the Gym Leader Sabrina. That went way more smoothly than I thought it would be. Seriously, I thought it went, would go way more longer. Well, now that we're done with that, there's only one more gym leader to rematch. And that's Blaine. Hillary, what do you want? Alright, whatever. Okay, so in the next episode, we'll be taking on the final rematch. And that is with Blaine. So I'll see you all next time. Stay tuned for more Pokemon Soul Silver. And I'll see you all next time. My whole team did a great job in that battle. It went way more smoothly than I thought it would go.